Hello and welcome to My Dad Says Audio. If you've been here before, welcome back. If you're new here, welcome. Uh, today we'll be looking at the Proton AM455 integrated amplifier. Uh, Dad, what can you tell us about the Proton? Uh, Proton's a bit of an interesting company. Uh, it's not sort of well known, but they actually produced uh, uh, NAD amplifiers for quite a while uh, to add specifications. And uh, uh, as you might have gathered by looking at this, they also made amps themselves. Uh, I used to work in a shop that sold Proton uh, many years ago, many moons ago. And uh, uh, I happened in my travels to pick, pick this particular model up. I think it's one of their more notable, one of their more notable amplifiers. Uh, it's a class AB amplifier rated very conservatively at 50 watts per channel. Um, and it's uh, quite comparable to say the better NAD slash Rotel type type of amplifier. Um, this one's quite notable in as much as it, it c comes fitted with all these Weimar caps. I think they're mostly in the preamp section. Uh, it's a nice clean layout. Uh, quite a huge power supply. It's got a 360 VA um, toroidal transformer supplying the juice if you like it's also notable they they released a few of these with with uh uh core transformers rather than a troidal transformer which is sort of an interesting point another point of interest is the actual phono stage you might look and go oh you know that's pretty neat it's all shielded and everything in actual fact i believe that the marketing department forced the engineering department to uh, include a phono stage. So almost out of spite, the uh, engineers turned around and put in the, the uh, mm, there's no polite way of putting it, crappiest phono stage I think they could have designed for it. When you, I have actually uh, got under there and replaced a couple of caps in there. Uh, you get in there, there's a little inline op amp, which must have been the cheapest dual op amp that the engineers could find, and that's your phono stage. It's probably the only thumbs down part, I'd say, for this amp. It's rated very conservatively at 50 watts a channel. I'm quite sure it puts out a fair bit more. I've totally recapped this. Uh, also took the opportunity to uh, uprate the the main reservoir caps for the uh, power amp section of it. And uh, I think there was, there was 10,000, each one of these in the, originally was 10,000 microfarad, well I've gone to 12,000 mic, microfarad. Same voltage of course, I'm not, I'm not uh, a maniac. Uh, so you've got a little bit more basic storage there. Uh, I changed the voltage regs, which which are these two two bits here, um, to better voltage reg regulators. Almost all the other elect electrolytics I've put in uh, Elnacelmix. That's quite a nice sounding amp. I mean, I must admit, I've sort of over the years erred more towards Class A transistor designs and... Uh, uh, sort of the more reasonable, better valve amplifiers, but uh, nonetheless, I still think I still rate this as being quite a quite a nice amp. Um, it's it's quite comparable to the, the NAT amps. Uh, if if I've got a speaker, if I've got a speaker that requires a bit more current delivery, this is actually quite a good option. And you've got two of them, I believe. Yes, I've got another one that I've got to uh, recap as well. I'll eventually get around to doing that. I've got all the bits and pieces there. But, uh, yeah, 
it's it's for what it is it's actually quite nice amp with the exception of the phono stage I would not rate the phono stage at all that's uh, I think it's actually quite amusing because this I believe came around came out in the mid to late 90s maybe 97 98 something like that um, and at that time basically most people you know, things have changed. Most people had gotten rid of their turntables. So I think the engineers, they actually must have re resented being told by the marketing department, you must include a phono stage in it. I definitely wouldn't rate the phono stage in it. But the, the line level part of it, the power amp, the preamp section of it, oh, it's, it's, all, it's all quite nice. Cool. Mm. All right. Well, that's the Proton... <laughs> AM455 integrated amplifier. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you enjoyed the video, please consider liking, commenting, subscribing and sharing. Until next time, take it easy. Bye.